invited us to go down. But he was a great mentor uh, to all of us in the meaning, and actually in the book that Jim has asked me to take home, The Treasure Principle, they talk about in that book, and it's a great book, and it is uh, not only a book that you go through one time, but it's a book that you need to have as a resource and go back and read on a regular basis. And in that, it said, like playing the piano, giving is a skill, and it's got to be practiced. And at the same time, I also think it has to be mentored. Uh, you have to be able to uh, look and uh, see people like my father who might not be able to give everything or huge sums of money, but really model what it means to, to give. And when I was a young coach, I was confronted with a very difficult job. Actually, it was a, one of those make or break jobs. And I was kind of on a search for what, it would, uh, what I would need to really get this horribly losing team that I just took over to a championship level. And I went on a, a search for uh, what the word excellence really meant, whether it was in athletics or business or serving people in the community. And I literally went into the library and looked at every different definition of excellence. And I wanted one that would, could be my personal mission statement. And of all the people that offered a definition of excellence, I found the definition that I've been hanging my hat on for the last 30 years from a chicken farmer named Frank Perdue. And he had a wonderful, wonderful <coughs> definition of excellence. He said, excellence is the unlimited ability to improve the quality of what you have to offer. <laughs>